Hello, welcome to a not so awesome review. And today we're looking at the Yu Gi Oh! Yami Yu Gi Funko Pop number 387 in the line. And he looks pretty darn good. There is one major error on him, which really bugs me. But aside from that, he looks really good. The hair, I think, was done really well. You can see the Millennium puzzle. I can't know if I said that right, but the, the puzzle's right there. It has the eye right there. It looks really good. Kind of floating outward with the chain and everything, which is awesome. See, he has his cards right here as well as a card in his hand. I do wish he was wearing a dual disc. That would be my only complaint. Same thing with Kaiba, and you know, you'll see that review when it comes out. But yeah, missed opportunity. I, I wish they had the dual disc right there, but you can see he's wearing the shirt like the cape. You can see his deck right there for his cards, which is awesome that that's there. That's attention to detail, and I love it. The studs on his belt look good. Same on the shoe, the pants, the blue looks really good. Uh, my only complaint is that the eye isn't filled in completely black which is fixable it's black i'm sure if you get a black marker and kind of just fill it in there you'll be fine so you know if yours is like that don't worry too much obviously look for the best one as possible like i always say but if it's the only option and you get it you can definitely fix that no problem uh the hair is pretty good there's a little bit of like glue going on there which is kind of odd because i don't know what part is glued on maybe maybe the bangs but i don't know how the glue ended up there See, the back of his hair is the right color of, I, I don't want to say purple, because it's not purple, but that color that's similar to purple, if you know what I'm, I mean, you're looking at it, you know what I'm talking about. But yeah, the hair, I think, came out good. It looks like Yugi, uh, Yami Yugi, anyway, Atom, right? You know, the pharaoh. Awesome, love it. And again, I do recommend it, though... I will say, you know, the other, the, the actual monsters are probably my favorite thing of the series. Don't get me wrong, loving Yugi, loving Kaiba, and I hope they make uh, Teya and Joey and Mai and all the other group, but I'm, I'm more in the monsters at this point because they just have so much detail. Not that he doesn't, but yeah, it would be cool to get like a regular Yugi and all that. So is it a good bop? Yes. Do I recommend it? Yes. If you were choosing between this and Dark Magician Girl, I think it's a no-brainer to get Dark Magician Girl or Blue Eyes White Dragon. But obviously, get what you like, whoever your favorite is. Maybe you don't like Dark Magician Girl and you just want Yugi, go for it. You know, you guys get what you want. As a quick size comparison, here she is next to the Dark Magician Girl. And I said she, I know. That's that's my bad with the pronunciations. But here's next to Dark Magician Girl. You can see that she is about the same size. I mean, the top of her little hat thingy is about the same Height as the top of his head, and they look pretty good together. And uh, yeah, hoping for a dark magician and more of these pops, hopefully, coming out. I uh, know we'll see. Anyways, this review was brought to you guys by the AV Pop Shop. Check out their Instagram linked in the description down below. Uh, I keep forgetting to mention this he does have a base, and Dark Magician Girl did have a base too, just so you know. So you can plug them into that, make them stand. And anyways, uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm kind of forgetting my own outro here. Uh, just thanks for watching, I guess. Subscribe and comment and all that cool stuff, and I'll see you later. Goodbye.